All right, YouTube, look here. We're making this thing fast. We're gonna put our boat in. We're gonna do some stuff different. Y'all see who in the driver's seat today. I got Grizz in the driver's seat. It's me and my G3. As you see, y'all, not only are we gonna crop it fish today, but we're gonna drop some, some noodles. We're looking for some catfish today too. So we're gonna do a combo trip. Y'all stay tuned. We're gonna show y'all what we do. catfish today so we're gonna catfish today with these some people call it jugging because they used to use jugs um, some people call it noodling but you know not to be confused with jumping in the water and putting your hands in the hole and noodling them out so but we, they call it noodling because we use pool noodles so yep my son showed me this and it's he I think he learned via a gentleman <clears throat> from Louisiana that's now in Virginia, Mr. Curtis Woods. Y'all check him out, Woods Family um, Outdoors on YouTube, good friend of ours. But this is all the time we're using, y'all. This is regular twine, this is one weight, and we're using a circle hook. So yesterday what he did, what you do yesterday, man, we caught, we caught the bluegill, then he's cut the bluegill up. Bluegill up and uh, right here, I just got a little head. Yep, got the head on. We're gonna chuck them in. And the other thing I want you to know about, we have a weight in here, y'all. So we gonna put it in flat like this. And then when the catfish hits it, you hear that weight hit, he'll use the jerk and we'll, it'll stand up like this, just like a barber that you fishing for bluegill with. So listen, y'all stay tuned. We're gonna place these out and see if we can show y'all some catfish too. We've never catfished this lake before. But we gotta try it. I got uh seen this on YouTube from a guy. I forgot his name, but he did chicken and uh he got strawberry jello and I added some garlic powder and a little bit of salt and it toughened up for me real nice so it'll stay on the hook real good and we will see what happened. I hadn't heard so many claims that this stuff really worked magic, so we gonna see. While we got these sitting, y'all know what we're gonna do. We're gonna drop some jig on the brush valve and see if we can catch some problems.
got one stand up. Catfish home, baby. Catfish on a Jello chicken. Jello chicken with garlic powder. <laughs> Make a believe out of me. supposed to do we did well you all saw um earlier we caught some crappie we caught some catfish and that was the whole goal never catfished this place before so we thought we'd try it y'all see grids back there and listen let me show you what we got to end the day off with we got a few crappie and we got a nice catfish listen every time you go fishing you don't have to catch a limit but guess what sometimes you need to limit yourself so that's what we did today um, it got hot on us today. Today's supposed to be 97 degrees. So you know what? We try to get in and get out. So now Grizz is nice and hot. I'm nice and hot. Now we need some nice cold refreshment. We can't wait to get our slurping. This is Feathers and Family Outdoors. Y'all take care of yours.